Johnny Jans here and I'm back at Islands of Adventure. So that means it's time to head on inside. It's dark. Let's do some hand ring around. And welcome everybody to my day three adventure here at Universal Studios and Islands of Adventure. So like the sign says up there, let the adventure begin. Going through Harry Potter right now. You can see the Christmas crowd, the holiday crowd, still here. They're out still in full force. Universal has not calmed down as we make our way through the Wizarding World tonight. And it always looks so nice at night. I like it. <laughs> when you look up. Not so much when you look down. But when you look up, it looks nice. That's how you have to walk through here, with your head slightly ajar to the top. And then you can really enjoy Hogsmeade. Here we are just outside Hogwarts Castle and the crowd's kind of being divided. Half the crowd actually watches the show. There's a fireworks show that happens on the castle right now but that is not what I'm gonna do so I'm trying to stay to the left and just get over to ride some hippogriff right now because I got Junior Jans with me and he likes the roller coaster don't you bud? He does. So, we're going to go bow to Buckbeak the Hippogriff, pay our respects. And look just behind here, you can actually see Buckbeak the Hippogriff making his way through the posts. And that's where you bow. Pay your respects. Under the cover of darkness, the Hippogriff's going up. And we just took a flight on that thing. And it was pretty fun. Junior Jones loves it. And it's really neat going at night because you can see the lights on the Hogwarts Castle. So, it's gonna come right around this bend in just a second. There it goes. Night ride. Yeah, like I'm, like I was doing all my tea all the time and what did it go upside down? It didn't go upside down. <laughs> <laughs> did, did it do that in your mind? Yeah. Ah, nice. And there's the Hogwarts Castle behind you with projections. And here we are back at Jurassic Park, right where I was yesterday. And there's those awesome gates with the fire. And we did Camp Jurassic yesterday with Junior Jans. So I figured you did a Jurassic Park attraction. We're gonna look at the river adventure and I'm gonna go check out the gift shop for any cool stuff. And Jurassic Park's just still crowded. Not like it used to be. It used to be pretty empty here. But the whole crowd, and there's a Velocicoaster. 60 minutes for the Velocicoaster tonight, right over there. And we're making our way up the path. Look, there's my favorite Jurassic Park Jeep. Right there, number 23. Got a Spinosaurus behind it, watch out. So in case you're wondering why this video is at night too, because that's apparently when I can come and do my filming is here at night, mostly except for the weekends because I work during the weekdays. So it works best for me, go to work and then come home real quick, eat dinner and then off to Universal Studios for some epic fun. There's a Velocicoaster overshadowing over there. But check this out, one of my favorite rides, the Jurassic Park River Adventure. In my head it's the staple attraction here, the original where you go actually tour the uh, Jurassic Park compound and a lot of mayhem erupts in there. If you didn't know, it's actually a boat ride and it has a, uh, I believe it's an 80 foot drop straight down in the dark after being chased by a Tyrannosaurus Rex. Highly recommend it. Just wanna get a grab this chance to see this spot and watch a boat actually come down from the ride and we can see the splash. This looks like a nice viewing area and it's well lit with the rocks and it feels like I'm peering in the Jurassic Park right now. And you can hear it, here it comes. 80 feet straight down and there's the splash. This is another perspective and of yeah. watching the boat. This is like a head-on perspective. Yeah, and the other keep lightning. That means when the boat comes down. That's right, what he said. <laughs> Waiting for it. Right now, the T-Rex is stalking the boat at the top 
and there's only one escape, and that's straight down. Now you will get wet on this ride, or possibly soaked. That's what the video says when you wait in the queue line. And they're not lying. Sometimes, sometimes you don't get wet. Sometimes you do. All depends where you sit. I try to avoid the front. Look at that, look at that splash down. And a beautiful shot of the boats right there. There it is, Jurassic Outfitters. This is the gift shop when you come outside of Jurassic Park the Ride. Uh, wait. Immediately, there's a lot of dinosaur stuff going on. And check out this awesome statue of a Velociraptor just hanging out above the merchandise. That's cool. You can see it's still decorated for Christmas. I love all the Jurassic Park dinosaurs lining the walls as far. And they also got the new Jurassic World Dominion logo up. So they must have just refurbish that because this place is all dominion like the trees so it looks like we're amongst the jungle or the jungle is invading the gift shop or maybe jurassic park's not inhabited anymore because the dinosaur escaped so here's one of my favorite details here in the gift shop these shelves that has all this cool merchandise here are actually when you step back they're the ride vehicles they're actually the boats that you ride on and check out this one looks like a dinosaur had a snack and took a piece off the front. I love that. But I love that the boats were hiding in here. I never knew that as the shelves. And you can see the bottoms are over there. Cool fact. And because I love this merchandise so much, I had to get something and I got Junior Jams this awesome Jurassic Park shirt. Cause he likes Jurassic Park just like daddy, right? Give it a big thumbs up for Jurassic Park. Love it. And then one day, you're gonna do the Jurassic Park River boat ride, right? Yeah, and the roller coaster. And the roller coaster, the Veloci coaster. I can't wait till you're big enough. Uh, I gotta talk about this awesome soda machine with the original Jurassic Park uh, tour guide car logo. It's that, that green Jeep coloring. Yeah, well, we're not going to get a soda now, but it does got a lot of tasty drinks in there. And check it out. It's the sign for the East Dock. One of my favorite signs ever. Junior Jams just pointed out the floor here. There's a giant emblem of a dinosaur for Jurassic Outfitters. In case you missed the sign on the top and you're looking up, you look down, there's the sign. Isn't that cool? And here I am again for my second day of a row at Camp Jurassic, climbing these nets and following this boy around as we meander our way through the, the crazy rope jungle. Well, look what Junior Jans has found. My old nemesis, the climbing wall next to the bench from yesterday. But this time you wanna go down instead of up, right? Oh, thank God, these go down. Oh God, here we go again. Oh, there's light in the darkness as I'm coming down. I'm gonna, ow, I'm gonna call this Jurassic, Jurassic stairs from now on. Cause I think I'm gonna be doing a lot of it. Where'd you go? Oh, it goes lower? Oh no, I didn't know that. I thought that was the end. He's down there. Oh, ow. I missed, I missed. I'm okay, I'm okay. I missed my step, I'm alive. Oh, oh God, okay. Oh, oh, whoa, there's more. This tower is huge. It just keeps going at the bottom. Oh, thank God. Oh, okay. Right. Oh, I got, made it to the bottom of Jurassic stairs. Oh no, he's going up. I think I'm going back up again, and then I think I'm done. I made it to the top of the Jurassic stair challenge. Could you imagine if I did that every day? I'm gonna be in shape. <laughs> well, there it is, folks. Another fun night here at Universal Studios, Islands of Adventure, and had a good time going on the Hippogriff with this guy here and checking out the Jurassic Park merchandise store off the Jurassic Park River Adventure. And surprise, went back to Camp Jurassic did that Jurassic Stairs Challenge 
So that's going to do it for me. As always, I'm Johnny Jans, and until next time, probably here at Universal, I'll catch you out there. <laughs> and this is what he likes to do. Take his time on the escalator. <laughs>